And even at the beginning of the level, when I'm watching the level, here I am at the very beginning, cool. You can see me here. I turn to my right, and guess what? There he is again! He's already throwing fireballs! It's way too early to be throwing fireballs, Bowser. I don't like it, man. I can even see Toad down there, ready to be rescued. That's what's so cool about playing this on an ultra-wide monitor. This is awesome. Hey everyone, it's Darby from Blue Television Games, and today we'll be playing Super Mario Brothers, but it's full screen Mario. Now what does this mean? Let's squash the Scoomba and find out. So, with this game, on your monitor, the larger you make the window, the larger the game is and the more you can see. Pretty crazy, huh? But I'm playing on my ultra wide curved screen monitor. So let's see how much of the level we could see if we make it full screen. Oh my gosh. There's the beginning of the level. And as we scroll through, we could see so, 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 so much, almost the entire level at once. This is gonna be awesome. Let's do it. All right, so what you're seeing now is I have a little layout here to make things a little easier to see if you want. Up at the top here, we got Mario. He's about to release this mushroom, boom, and collect it right here. Cool. But if you're having trouble seeing, I have a slightly bigger one below here that zooms in just a little bit. And the third one just zooms in just even a little bit more. That's if you want to see what's going on close up, but if you want, you're welcome to watch the very tiny screen at the very top. That's the one I'm going to be basically looking at, except, you know, I'm looking at it on my ultra wide monitor. It's not too small on it, but I'm sorry for your eyes. You're going to have to squint if you want to see that tiny little Mario on the screen. Awesome. Level one in the books. Doodly -doo. Uh oh, the game froze. No! It's okay if the map freezes because we can pick any map we want, including a map generator. Let's do that. All right, and now we're playing a totally random map. This is pretty cool too. So this is basically a Mario Brothers 1 randomizer where you can see almost the entire level all at once. Let's see if we can beat this random level. Do, 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 do. And here in a little bit, maybe we'll play 8-4 and try to beat the game. Why not? We got to try out an underwater level. Here's to see what that'll look like. And there's also these mods you can apply to the game, which I think might be pretty interesting to try. It's hard to tell how far you'll be able to jump sometimes. Oh my. Can we make this jump? That looks like a big jump. Let's try it. Oh, come on, I didn't jump for some reason. Dang it! All right, so these random maps are pretty tricky. Dang it! All right, we got one last try. Check that out. We can just kill the bullet bills nice and easy. Run across here. Whee! Yes! Don't die! <laughs> There's a little bit of slowdown. I think it's because there's so many bullet bills right now. Just check out all these bullet bills as they go across the screen. <laughs> so cool. I love it. All right, here goes nothing. Well, actually, hopefully something. Oh, the slowdown jumps are actually kind of cool. It's like slow motion. It makes it a little epic. I think I see how to do this, and I'm probably going to die, so... <laughs> I didn't see that coming. Dang, bullet bill got me. <laughs> Let's see what we can do with mods. So with mods, we have bouncy bounce. Let's try that. Also, if you hold in jump, you just keep on bouncing. That's pretty cool. I like it. Dark as the night is pretty cool. It makes everything go into nighttime mode, which looks pretty awesome. I like that. Earthquake. Oh, when you land, it shakes everything. That's actually really awesome. I like that. Mario causes earthquakes. That is pretty dang cool. All right, time for more mods. We got Gradient Skies, which uh, is kind of hard to see with this. Let me hide this real quick. As you can see in the top, especially, the sky kind of gets brighter as you go right. Eh, it's a little change, but it's neat. What else we got? Hard mode. Doesn't seem any harder to me. Huh, who knows? Hard mode probably does something. High speed. 
So with high speed, you just kind of slide on one foot and go pretty fast. It looks kind of like you're skating on ice. Alright, infinite lives obviously is, you know, infinite lives, I'm sure. Invincibility keeps you from getting hit by enemies, obviously. Parallax clouds, boom. Alright, so now as we move, you'll see that the clouds in the background move kind of separately from us. So it makes it feel like they're slightly farther away. Little parallax scrolling, pretty cool. Low gravity mode, probably just makes jumps kind of funny. Yeah, we can jump really high. That's definitely pretty nice. Luigi makes Mario. Well, Luigi, that's pretty sweet. I think we'll go ahead and leave this one on for now. Tilt gravity. What's tilt gravity mean? I don't know what tilt gravity does. I can't figure that one out. Palette swap. Whoa. <laughs> well, I mean, it looks pretty interesting. Definitely pretty weird. <laughs> Q count. All right, Q count's another one I don't understand. I can't tell what it does, sadly. Super fireballs. <laughs> I don't really understand it that much. Wait, I think they can blow up bricks. They can blow up everything. Super fireballs are awesome. Holy cow, look at this. I'm blowing up everything. So we can blow up the pipes? All right, so I am loving, <laughs> I am loving super fireballs. Mods, mods, mods. The last mod is called Trip of Acid. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa. This is getting way too crazy, way too quick. <laughs> Man, we need to play through one of these modes with one of these crazy mods. Oh my gosh, this is insane looking. I love it. Okay, this is really crazy. <laughs> All right, I know what we have to do. We have to turn on every single mod. It's just a fact. I know everyone's gonna wanna see it. Every single mod is now on. Let's reset the game. All right, let's refresh. We gotta get our other screens back because the camera won't follow. Here goes nothing. Oh yeah, we're invincible. We have the weird pallets. We have the acid mode on. We have low gravity. We have bouncy mode so we can just keep bouncing forever. Oh my gosh, this just looks like a mess. <laughs> I'm just holding jump. I don't even know if we can die in the pits. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh my gosh, what am I looking at? All right, that's every mod turned on. Pretty cool. Do note there's also an editor here where you can make your own levels. I couldn't figure it out, but if that's something you're into, it might be fun to mess with. All right, before we quit, let's try a water level and let's also try to uh, beat a castle level. Awesome. <laughs> it's just crazy being able to see so much of the level at once. It also makes me wonder if you could just let all these cheap cheeps go by. The bloopers seem to be a little bit crazier than normal Mario Brothers. I mean, they're really a swimming. This is kind of intimidating seeing all these cheap cheeps. Oh my gosh. So here's my screen and look at this right here. Oh my gosh. And then as I look to my right, there's so many cheap cheeps. How am I going to get out of here? All right, come over here, bloopers. Bloopers, please come over here. Please come over here. All right, in a minute, I'm going to swim for my life. If I hold left, can I trick them into going left? This is our only chance here. We're probably gonna swim into one of these cheap cheeps. Go, Luigi! Woohoo! That's a lot of bloopers back there after me. Go, Luigi! <laughs> this is so crazy. All right, I like it. Okay, it's, it's settled down now. This should be pretty easy. Luigi's moving a little slow, a little slowdown. For me, the slowdown's no big deal because this is just so neat. I've seen this before and thought about covering it so many times, but when I bought my ultra wide monitor, it was like the first thing that popped into my head was I gotta do full screen Mario. I want these coins. Why? I don't know. I just want them. Now here's a problem with my three screens right now is the bottom screen just stopped a little early. Then I have to watch the tiny screen. There's Luigi right there. See him? He's tiny. All right, into the old pipe -aroo. All right, so I'd like to hop a date four and try to beat the game real quick. But before we do that, let's play one four because I need to practice at one of these castle levels and see if they're harder. All right, here we go. Up 
over the fire bar. We need to get this mushroom. So when the level first starts up, this one's actually moving pretty smooth, but I see an issue already. Bowser's over there throwing so, so many fireballs. This is nuts. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of fireballs. Okay, we're probably gonna die. I'm gonna pause real quick. I wanna show you this from my perspective again real quick. So here I am getting ready to get killed. And if I look to my right, I can already see Bowser way at the end of the level throwing fireballs. What a jerk! All right, and even at the beginning of the level, when I'm watching the level, here I am at the very beginning, cool. You can see me here. I turn to my right, and guess what? There he is again, he's already throwing fireballs. It's way too early to be throwing fireballs, Bowser. I don't like it, man. I can even see Toad down there, ready to be rescued. That's what's so cool about playing this on an ultra-wide monitor. This is awesome. All right, now that we have a thousand fireballs to dodge, let's go ahead and beat this real quick. How hard could it be? The more fireballs there are, the slower the game gets. Ugh. Woo. Okay, so far so good. Okay, maybe the slow motion will help me? Go, Luigi! Okay, this one's... I'm gonna hit it if I keep going. Slow down. He almost seems like he's directly targeting me, too. Like, now that I'm up here, fireballs seem to be heading straight for my face. Could be wrong. Wow, this is so slow. <laughs> There's too many fireballs on the screen for the game to handle, I guess. Now we're gonna jump real, real high. Uh, yeah! Dramatic slow motion! <laughs> okay, and now we're going to go here and do the same thing again. Maybe a short jump. Large jump! There's no way we're getting through that, that's fine. We do have a shot to beat this, though. Jump, Luigi! It's so slow! <laughs> I think this one might hit us. It's kind of low. Go! <laughs> it's so, so slow. This is like dramatic cam or something. Okay. Uh, jump! Oh, over or under the ultimate decision I'm going over? No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Oh, hoo, 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 hoo. the slow motion is helping me like crazy. See you later, Bowser. <laughs> That's awesome! Alright, there's good old Toad. We rescued him. Thank you, Mario. I'm a Luigi, number one. Alright, I think we're ready for 8-4. Let's do it! Okay, so this looks weird. I feel like there's way more empty space than there normally is. Look at all this empty space up here. Luigi's like, uh, where's everything at, guys? <laughs> Mario! Okay. That was... Is it normally that big of an empty space in 8-4? I guess maybe it could be. I just walked through that piranha plant a little bit. That's fine. Maybe he likes me because I'm Luigi. I'm Luigi's green like he is. Hard to say. Well, the fire bars aren't... Or the fire balls aren't going. Some reason I always say fire bars. Uh, the game runs pretty smooth. Must just depend on how many enemies are on the screen. Okay. Buzzy Beats, I'm sorry! Don't kill me! Oh, no! <laughs> That was really, really close. A little bit too close. It made this part easier because the Koopa Troopas are like heading off to wherever. All right. If I had a mushroom, this would be a lot easier. We're gonna have to deal with Cheap Cheeps. We're gonna have to deal with, oh my gosh, these Cheap Cheeps are crazy. They're like all over the place. Please don't smash me while I'm recording this Cheap Cheeps. All right, here we are. I'm ready to die. Oh my gosh, we dodged it. If I look to my right though, there's just Cheap Cheeps everywhere. It's like there's Cheep cheeps. <laughs> Please don't kill me, cheep cheeps. Nee ha hoo ha ha. All right, all I gotta do is make it into this pipe and everything will be fine. Cool. If I had a power up, I'd feel a lot better. And we got the crazy, crazy bloopers. And we're dead. <laughs> Dang it. All right, I gotta figure out a way to get this blooper out of my way. There's three bloopers in here. It's kind of interesting to see how small this area is. I don't like this situation. If they can all sync up, I might be able to get out of here. <laughs> it's not looking great for Luigi right now. Okay, that's our chance. Now we just have to get out of here before these crazy bloopers kill us. It's easier to plan out your attack, or which way you want to go though, when you can see the entire section. We're almost to the end of the game. This part's gonna be hard as heck though, okay. We're gonna get by a Hammer Bro and a Bowser. And the Hammer Bros 
seem a little bit more random. Oh, and then there's fireballs everywhere. Oh my gosh. Okay. We need a miracle here. And there's a piranha plant too, which is pretty cool. And we dive, which is even better. Cool. All right, I'm gonna be honest. I went back and I got a fire flower from 8-3 because this was too hard. There's just so many fireballs to dodge. Now we can literally damage boost through. Oh, no, we can't because... Oh, come on! I'm hoping that I can finally finish this. If there isn't too many fireballs to dodge, I can't seem to kill this hammer bro, which is making me a little worried. Okay, I got the hammer bro on the way. If we can keep the fire flower, this should be easy. Okay, now we just gotta kill Bowser. Come on! Come on, man! <laughs> yes! See you later, Bowser, finally! All right, that was full screen Mario in ultra wide screen. All right, I hope you enjoyed the video. It was really fun messing around with full screen Mario on an ultra wide monitor. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel and you like what you see, be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you'll know when I release new videos. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, join the BTG Discord, and check out my merch all down in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, I'll see you around.